Undoubtedly, one of the gnarliest races of the season has just finished. It's a Red Bull Hardline that's taking place here in Wales. We're around at the pits and we're going to ask the pros what is the scariest feature they've had to tackle and what is also their favourite. So, let's find out. First question, what was the scariest feature of the Hardline course? Oh, probably the Renegade jump, yeah. What was your favourite? Uh, getting through the finish arch. <laughs> yeah, finishing the run. Yeah, no, yeah, finishing my final run and knowing that I'd uh, survive Red Bull Hardline without killing myself and being able to go home in one piece, yeah. Third place today, Adam Brayton. I want to know what the scariest feature on track was for you. Uh, none of it, mate. Just wasn't even scared, eh? And favourite feature? I reckon the Renegade, because yeah, if I'm honest, I was scared of it at first, but once you got that thing sent, it was, it was sick. So we've got Matt Walker, Rupert Chapman, and we want to know what the scariest feature is. For me, it'd have to be the first jump, eh? It's pretty big. It's sketchy. <laughs> yeah, it'd have to be the drop in the woods for me as well. Both claimed us, so... <laughs> Run one? Run one. Run one. <laughs> Alex Bond? Scott Lockland. What's your favourite feature on track? Uh, the finish line. <laughs> and the scariest? Uh, well, for me, the Renegade step up. Um, it was fine in practice. I wasn't bothered about it at all. Coming into the event, not bothered about it. But seeing three people get quite badly hurt on it kind of changed the way I viewed it and saw how things could go, go wrong quite easily. And then everyone else was getting nervous about it, so it was built up to this big thing. And actually, it was quite an easy jump. It was just the tolerance of like whether it would go right to wrong was quite close. Brick McDonald, what is your favourite feature of Hardline? My favourite feature, uh, probably the finish line. And the scariest? Um, probably the Renegade, for sure. It's not scary, but it's just I don't know. I guess it's unpredictable sometimes. If you're not confident, I don't know. The whole track, uh, it's pretty scary. Got Bernard Kerr, this year's winner, and the first question I'm going to ask you is, what is the scariest feature of Hardline? Um, the scariest one probably is the Renegade, because you've got a break for it. Like, if you went as fast as you can, it'd be easy, but you land the cannon before, come in absolutely pinned, and then you've got to try and work out how much the brake and how much the tailwind is, so probably that. And then what is your favourite feature? Um, maybe that as well, when you get it good, probably, actually. That thing is sick when you get it good, or... The, or the road gap, you accelerate so fast off it, like 0 to 60 in, I don't know, half a second, so one of those two. Mick Hanna, got two questions for the first one is, what was the scariest feature at Hardline? Oh, the scariest feature for Hardline, I would say, was the Renegade jump. And it wasn't that it was a tough jump, but the wind was really variable, so it was really difficult to judge. And what was your favourite feature? Uh, whew. hmm. My favourite feature, I guess, is the whole track combined. That's what I loved the most, was each feature on its own is not necessarily the hardest thing I've ever done, but to combine everything into one, that's what makes the course so unique. Joe Smith, first question I'm going to ask you, favourite feature of Hardline? That's a tough one. I like that big, um, that big hip over the wall. That's good fun. I, I kind of got into it last year and then this year it was just a bit easier and you could just kind of let it float you up. So yeah, that was ace. And then the big one, what is the scariest feature? Um, I think for the whole weekend, the scariest feature was definitely the Renegade. That was, uh, it was a big gnarly jump and it took a lot of the riders out. And it took me a while to, um, I did it quite early on, but then it took me a while to perfect it and then get the jump before it into it. Once I did that this morning, I was buzzing and yeah, it was ace. Taylor Vernon, I want to know what your favourite feature of Hardline is. The finish line? <laughs> nah, joking. I reckon that road gap, just every time you come into it, you know you're just going to be in the air for so long. You look into your side and there's just people there, like, let's just line, like, you know, and just landing. This massive right turn, just slinging it around. Sick. And the scariest one? Renegade for sure. Every time you come into it, you just, you never really know the speed and the wind, so you're just judging it, like, by feel as you're there. And, I come up pretty short on my finals run and that definitely put, got my heart racing. So we've got Ruri Cunningham. Ruri, what is your favourite feature on the Red Bull Hardline course? The finish line. And the scariest? The start line. <laughs> 
So there you go. If you've been watching, then let us know in the comment section down below what would be the scariest thing for you to tackle, or what would be your favorite. And if you want to watch some more videos from GMBN, why don't you click just up there for the full Pro Bike playlist. And if you click down there, you're going to get to find out what Hardline is all about. Don't forget to click on that globe to subscribe, because you'll get a great video every single day of the week.